Hello. So recently there has been a spate of complaints regarding drones. Now I haven't had the luxury of meeting a drone out hacking yet. Um, but I will say if my horse spooks or shies or reacts badly to that then I will put that down to that I haven't prepared her properly so while people are going to change legislation in the use of drones I would say in the meantime whether that goes whether anything comes of that or not I don't know but in the meantime I would say go out and buy a drone or borrow a drone or maybe the whole yard could chip in and school your horses with a drone so go into the school and show your horse the drone it's going to turn it on straight away get your horse used to seeing the drone have somebody hold the drone up move around the horse with it keep it still while you turn it on allow the horse to get used to the noise um, you know even the horse should get used to that we are so much of our horses they become desensitized to so many things or at least comfortable and trust their rider enough to stay calm we go to so much trouble to school our horses with dogs and trucks and bikes and quad bikes and um, motorbikes, um, blowing bags, birds coming out of trees. We go to so much effort to try and have a safe hack and unfortunately exposing our horses to drones just seems like something else we're going to have to add to the list just to ensure our own safety. Now as we all know just because our horse gets used to something in the school doesn't mean you know the horse is going to accept that two miles out from the yard so if safe to do so go to a quiet field hack your horse there have somebody follow you with the drone take it really slowly that you know there's no need to rush a horse if it's done properly it won't be rushed anyway the horse can days weeks let the horse get used to this drone in its own time it's just not worth the risk in my in my in my humble opinion that when we hack out now we just don't know what we're going to meet and I'd rather not be going out my horse hates motorbikes and I'd rather not be going out meeting motorbikes she's fine with them on the road like I said she doesn't expect them to see them in the countryside so um, she she doesn't have a good reaction to off-road motorbikes but in time we can desensitize our horses to most things with enough patience so I, I would definitely recommend now in you know the 21st century we have to keep up with progress here especially in the southeast we're just getting squeezed out there's just there's just nowhere to safely hack but then when I say safely hack you know, I, does that mean I'm expecting to see absolutely nothing at all that my horse might not like? And okay, that'd be great, but that just isn't realistic riding, is it? We we have to train these horses in so many aspects. Um, perhaps a whole yard could chip into that drone or borrow one. Everyone must know someone with a drone and just take it really slowly. It would be nice to be in a position where, you know, you're putting your foot in that stirrup and you're going to be out for a couple of hours and you can be confident that ever whatever you're going to meet your your horse is going to be comfortable with and you're going, you're going to be both kept safe you're going to be coming back to the yard in one piece it, you know just do everything you can every time you hear someone complaining about something they've met out on a hack think well i could spend the next couple of weeks schooling my horse to be comfortable with that but everyone should just try and do everything they can to try and stay safe and try to keep hacking and try to enjoy their horses and horses will get used to most things if not everything it would be nice if horses were just something we could tack up and go for a pleasant ride on or have a nice time in the school and have a fantastic session but horses are hard work and they take an awful lot of training and exposure to an awful lot of things in in our world so, but I definitely think it's worth the effort just to ensure your own safety. Okay, see you soon.